The Interaction Design Team at the Royal College of Art have invented an object called the Drift Table. Steve Honest has been living with it for about two and a half weeks now, and we're going to ask him what he thinks it is. Steve, tell us, what exactly is the Drift Table? I'd describe it as a digital hot air balloon that you travel in from the comfort of your own front row. Because just like hot air balloon, you look over the edge or through this lens, which could be the edge, and you just drift around from place to place. And all you do is pick a direction you want to drift in and place weights in that direction. So you place a rock to go west, and if you want to go a bit faster, add some more rocks. I now finally understand that I'm not to uh, really control it apart from tell it which direction I want to drift in. So, you know, all the technology in the drift table is within as opposed to without. There are no buttons and keys to press or anything. All, everything is within. And the only interaction I have really is to look through the lens or to place weights in the direction I want to go. And that is what it does. And, you know, if you want to do anything, more than that, you really should be looking at maybe buying a PlayStation. <laughs> this is what it does, and it does it really, really well. So what do I think of the drift table? Well, when I first heard about it, I thought it might be a gimmick or some kind of techno experiment. But for me, it's an art installation that functions very well as a piece of furniture too. And would I want one? Yep. I, I really liked it at first, then I went off it because there were no buttons to play with. And now I'm really, really back into it. And I kind of like the way that it's changed my attitude towards it in that I've, the whole thing of wanting to control it has worn off now. I kind of just like drifting with the drift table.